Hello, truth seekers, and welcome back to our channel, where we unveil the shocking truth behind the glamorous world of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Today, we're diving into the drama that's got Montecito buzzing, tongues wagging, and Meghan Markle shedding a tear or two. Oh, the intrigue. Buckle up, because we're about to dissect the latest in the royal soap opera that's unfolding in the most unexpected of ways. But before we move on to any further details, I would love to thank you all for your enormous love and support, and in case you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting for, guys? Hit the subscribe button now, and don't forget to press the bell icon. Perfect. So let's get started. Now, if you thought the world of monarchs was all tea parties and tiaras, think again. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge, William and Kate, have apparently unleashed a stealthy counterattack that's left Montecito's newest residents, Meghan and Harry, quaking in their designer boots. Meghan's 42nd birthday came and went, but what's this? Not a peep, not a whisper, not even a royal eyebrow raise from the senior royals. Ouch. Now I don't know about you, but I can almost hear the sound of Meg's heart shattering like fine china. Oh, the drama, the betrayal, the hashtag. Meghan deserves better is all happening, folks. But wait, there's more. Our royal expert du jour, Hillary Fordwich, has a theory that is juicier than a ripe Windsor grape. She's claiming that the Cambridge duo not only ignored Meghan's birthday, but they definitely snubbed her. Oh, the audacity. Because apparently last year, they were all about the love, posting birthday wishes with a photo and all. But hold your horses, it gets spicier. This year, they decided to throw their well wishes at a wildlife documentary team instead. Yep, you heard me right. They sent their digital cake emojis and party hats to the rhino man. But Megan? Nada. Zilch? Zero. It's like they looked at her birthday and thought, nah, let's save our social media magic for some rhinos. Now, let's talk about King Charles III, shall we? He's following protocol, they say. Oh, the good old protocol. He didn't wish Megan a happy birthday because the late queen used to reserve those wishes for working royals. But let's be real here. That's like sending someone a slice of cake but not actually letting them eat it. And here's where it gets extra juicy. Hillary Ford, which has an opinion on this too. She's basically saying, sure, he's following protocol, but he doesn't have to. He's the king, for crying out loud. He could update the rule book, toss it out the palace window, or even invent a new version of Happy Birthday. The possibilities are endless. But what's the tea, you ask? Well, Hillary thinks this whole lack of birthday love is a neon sign pointing to a frosty relationship between Meghan and the monarchy. It's like Montecito's got a new cold front rolling in, and it's not just from the ocean breeze. So what do you think about this news? As always, these are my controversial opinions, and I'd love to hear yours in the comments below. Until then, stay tuned for more shocking stories and scandalous exposés on our YouTube channel. Remember to like and share, and subscribe to stay updated on the latest. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again for more fascinating news about the royal family. Bye for now.